Hi, I'm Conan Elliott. I'm the Director of Instruction here at Camas Meadows Golf Club in Camas, Washington. Today we're going to talk about how to get more distance out of your driver. The materials we need here are a driver, a golf ball, and a practice range in order to be able to work on that swing. Probably the number one question of all golfers wants, how can I hit it further? Everyone wants to hit it further. Well, there's several aspects to that. One is the actual path of the golf swing that you make. The other is the equipment you use, such as the driver that you have, the, the amount of loft on it, whether it's a, a low loft such as an 8 or an 8.5 degree, or maybe even up to a 13 degree driver. Uh, that has a lot to do with it is in, in how steep you swing into a ball controls how, how high the ball comes off the club, controls how far it goes. So having the club fitted to you is very, very important in the head. Then the shaft, the shaft that you're using. Too stiff a shaft, the shaft won't kick for your amount of swing speed and make the ball go further. Too soft a shaft, it'll actually flex too much and you'll hook it and not hit it as far. So getting the shaft fit to you, getting the right loft on the club to you is a first step in learning to hit the golf ball further. Second of all, to hit the golf ball further is the type of ball you're using. Some people that have a slower speed that use a very high compression golf ball don't compress the golf ball enough for it to explode off the club face and for it to go further. Some people the opposite, they use too soft a ball, it compresses too much, then it doesn't actually fly off the club face either. So getting the equipment fit to your particular swing is the first step in hitting a golf ball far. Second of all is the actual swing you make. You know, golf's a game of centrifugal force in a circle. Learning to swing the golf club in a circle around our body creates centrifugal force and huge, huge amount of, of pressure out on the head of the club, which goes fast. Not necessarily do we go fast. Most people that go to hit it har farther do two things. They hold on tighter and they swing their arms faster. <laughs> And really, that doesn't create any force at all on the head of the golf club. Actually, as the great Jack Nicklaus said, the further I try to hit it, the lighter I hold on to it. So actually, to hit it far, we want to get rid of that, that oof and relax, lighten our hands, and learn to turn our body, the club, around our body and to create circles. Circle the golf club. As long as I'm creating centrifugal force, then I'll be able to hit the ball far. The circling comes not with my arms, but with the core of my body, learning to turn the core of my body around my spine. The better I coil, the better I turn, the further I hit it. The more I use my hands and arms, the more effort I'll use, but the shorter I'll hit it. So. In essence, get the clubs that fit you, get a ball that fits your swing, learn to turn and keep your hands and arms quiet in the golf swing. I'm Conan Elliott and that's how we learn to hit a driver further.